Maybe yeah, stuff Malcolm's fun. a bit of a cunt. <laughs> I, can, I can agree there, but uh, he, his videos are still quite fun. Yeah. Hmm. He, he does like, still make some pretty decent shit, like a lot of his stream snipes and all. Like when he's actually like not being a massive dick, he actually makes some pretty decent shit. Yeah. Videos. Yeah, like but, he, does, like but he never, right but he doesn't want to do any of those fucking tutorials and shit, and I'm like, oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, I, I get you, I get you trying to, you know, keep the information to yourself, but you know. Yeah. If you, I, you it's really, if you're the information to himself and stuff, it, it's always also like one of his own. Yeah, if you want to like, like, you know, show off your secrets and shit. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's like half the fun though. It's like not showing people how you do this so you don't get like a bunch of assholes that do it, but then like just be complete cunts about it. Oh, I'm triggered the trap. Yeah. Oh. I also didn't find that red jelly. I thought the red jelly was so sweet in this area. No, red jelly is in the next area. Oh, okay. Okay, well, let's get. What? What? <sighs> Still yeah, I can definitely see how, uh, why, why, and see how, how and why, like, people uh, hate Malcolm and shit, but it's like. Sometimes he does some funny shit, like, uh, light shows and shit. That shit's funny. That's for sure. Ow. Get off me, you little Ooh. fucking slugger. You slugger. You boys fucking, uh, fucking, I love that video, the fucking, uh, I reminded myself of it, fucking Siggy butt brain, that shit's fucking hilarious. That is like the funniest video I've ever, ever seen is the Siggy butt brain video. Huh. It's so funny, I don't know if you've seen it, it's like the funniest shit ever. <sighs> okay, when, when, when we're done with both our videos, so I'm gonna go to the, go and get some coffee. Ah, okay. I was I was supposed to do that and like hand it over that thing, your dark soul. Well, I didn't even notice this, but uh, it's uh, the ice is actually one of the uh, the actual uh, illusionary wall ones. It's got a illusionary wall can be found in the first layer, located in the pre-boss area inside a room housing a keeper of the Lord enemy, keeper of the old Lord enemy. Huh. You go there, you can yeah. find the. Uh, it's the Charles oh, dungeons that have the uh, illusionary walls. Yeah. This guy's so boring. He just runs and then charges in. Oh, that's cute. Um, well, what are you playing? DS3. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I'm wait while well, I'm waiting at the thing, waiting for your. Uh... Damn, I'm looking at your thing. You got the five fades edition. Damn, that fucking art. Yeah. Yeah, that's that super swanky. I want. I want to get a Japanese. Huh. Oh, I want to get a Japanese copy of it so bad, just so I have the the soundtrack DLC, like official release. Ah, uh, yeah. I don't want. I, I don't want to. I don't want to have to like you know listen to it on the interweb zone. Make sure from software gets a little bit of the cash they so deserve, you yeah. know. <laughs> oh shit, that's a really nice shot, dude. This guy is a, he posted on the Rainbow Six subreddit a once in a lifetime shot. He fucking shoots his shotgun at the wall and it, it like legitimately makes a smiley face. Two eyes and like huh. a big open happy mouth. That's so fucking random. Holy shit. The Maybe that's bullet editing. No, no, that'll be, that uh, that'll be like legit. That, that's really difficult to pull off on a, like on accident or on purpose. Huh. Okay, bonus room back here, so I guess we're gonna check that first. So yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's see. Actually, what was he on? <laughs> oh, yeah, he was like he was on PC, but no, yeah, that was like no way that was uh, cheating. Because that is because you, you can't do bullet editing. You know, in the six hour one. There's nothing that's gonna do that. I don't believe. Oh. I might be wrong, but I do not. Oh. Lag? Yeah. Huh. That's interesting. Hmm. Mm. Uh, uh. 
az incident out and Yeah. Actually, is the red jelly in this bonus section or is it uh, before Briatus? It's before every. Okay, yeah, I guess I'll just leave this area. I was gonna do the you know, other section. Oh, yeah, 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 you don't wanna do that area anyway. It's got some cancer in there that you don't need to be a part of. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty fair. Yeah, I'm coming back. Yeah, I just went ahead and re, re uh, redid my shit. Mm. Honestly, if I had that fiber optics there, maybe I wouldn't have this kind of connection issue. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like once every play session, when it comes to parties, I'll usually just get disconnected because of the. Uh, maybe I'm waiting at the lab, waiting for your uh, bell to be summoning. Yeah. Mm -hmm. summon to, yeah, to summon your bell to be able to summon me. Send a container. <laughs> Do this. Like mm -hmm. really decent, like really, really good Deadpool cosplay meta, like a sort of shitty Thor cosplay, Bye. but still a Thor cosplay. And he fucking, he's like, can I, can I just try to hold the, uh, the hammer? And he's like, yeah, sure, dude. And oh. Needs to die now. Yeah, they all drop Twisted Gods, bro. Just like that one. That one decided to give me a fucking blood gem. Sweet. Oh, a little summon thing. Who is this? Prospector Grimia. Oh, there is werewolves there. That's not fun. Give me a werewolf bitch. Let me have that, that thick. Oh, fuck. I don't want one second. I got addicted. <sighs> what the awesome thing was with like giving you uh, more blood, uh, blood vials and quick civil like, They put so much love and care into this game compared to its fucking counterpart Dark Souls 2. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, if you get hit by that, you're gonna good. die. I was, I was checking to see which way. Let's go We'll go the other way after. Yeah, I was just checking to see which way it was coming from first. I like these little loot rooms where it's like there's a nice big thing to have some chests in it and shit. Maybe an enemy. Or two. You're getting killed by brain sucker. Ooh boy. They're dead. Trying to open all the chests. Chests. Love chests. Hey, Red Jelly. Hey, Red Jelly. That's one or two. There we go, there's the other ones. Oh, that also reminds me of another great thing about this game. I always remember great things about this game. It's like, you can parry both normal attacks and heals, which is fucking awesome. Yep. Great system. The door down here opens. Oh yeah, shortcut door. Wait, shortcut door or I don't know, like yeah, I don't know what time it is. Shortcut door. Where the fuck is the ladder? There it is. I, that's really the greatest thing I think I love about this game is you can parry uh, when somebody tries to kill you. It's good if you're like if you're just a fucking good shot and you know when the you know the timing and stuff. It's good for punishing dumbasses who think they can like spam like just instantly try to attack you and then try to like spam you and shit. Yeah, it's like once, the, once you like punish them for trying to like spam attack you by this or whatever. They immediately regret it, so they have to go heal, but then you eat some this or whatever. It's like so good. Okay, let's do this. Oh. No, I didn't get this Okay, that's fine. Oh shit, didn't get this game. Looks like not. Not necessary. Okay, 18 vials, uh, 20 bullets, and uh, execution bullets. And a scythe. And a gun. And a uh, really irritating boss. Oh no. <laughs> I, I like these bosses, but it's like when you put, a, put like these big ass bosses in these tiny rooms, it's like, come on, what were you thinking?
Ow! Fuck you, Ariadus. Fucking big ass. Now I know this shit's like toned down on purpose because it's Charles Dungeon, but I mean sometimes I swear it's just a bit too, just a bit too easy. Like, they're too like lax. Oh, you like, say just... that? Curse Rod and Feeded. What? A Curse Rod and Feeded Dungeon. With every atus at the end, will eat your health. Oh, that's fucked. Yeah, dude. I'm gonna guess you probably, uh, probably don't have that, but that sucks, dude. Okay, I'm gonna quick, uh, restock, and then I'll start reading my belt. Cool. Yep. Yes. 65, 25, 40, uh, sorry, 50, 50, 12, 50. I'll probably then start bringing up blood pinch to 50. And then endurance or whatever. Progress through each thing. Here I come. I guess we're just probably just gonna bum rush the, uh, thing. You're gonna go get each other. Go get the lock. Then we'll go uh, uh huh. Get some coffee. You want me to uh bring in the lamp or Yeah at the lamp, yeah. Okay, yeah. now I just have to wait. Anyway. Shouldn't be too hard. Uh the rear challenge is like the queen really, I guess. Visceral. Sometimes it's nutty how much damage you can do with a visceral. Oh yeah, and I have 99 yeah. skill, so it's gonna be like ridiculous. Oh yeah. yeah. True that. Yeah, you're like what max level are you? Yeah. yeah. Pretty good. Even by max level stats, considering this is fucking this is Bloodborne. Like, yep. Max low stats, it's just, it's pretty in Bloodborne, that's for sure, I know that much. It's like, it's not the same with like, uh, soft caps and hard cap systems. I know there is the same system, but it's like, Dark Souls 2, 1, 2, 3, like, the, it was pretty overpowered to be a like, max level shit. Mm -hmm. I mean, like, I do have a max level character in DS3 as well. Nice. I think really when it comes down to it, it's like max level on Bloodborne. Nobody really thinks about it unless you're like obviously trying to do it because it's like. I'm, I might as really well. Gets. I thought I was like, you know what? I might as well get this character max level. Yeah. I see. I hate it. <laughs> that was good shit. You're probably just gonna go rush the uh, the lever because if you do that, I'll yep. go wait at the uh, door.
Wow. Yeah, that should not have been super easy. That's like oh. sad like how easy that was. Oh yeah. Okay, time for the uh, hilt chalice, I suppose.